Well, today is World Refugee Day, and here in Philadelphia, the city is hosting a festival and the screening of a film which profiles Syrian families struggling to find their way in America. Eyewitness News reporter Shantae Lands is live at City Hall tonight with more. Shantae? Well, Jess and Yuki, there are more than 700 refugees living in Philadelphia, and today Mayor Jim Kenney honored all of them and the millions of others across the globe. Philadelphia is, a, is proud to participate in World Refugee Day. As a welcoming city, we know the value that our refugee communities add to our city. Mayor Jim Kenney speaks out on behalf of the city of Philadelphia, celebrating World Refugee Day. The local nonprofit, the Philadelphia Regional Refugee Providers Collaborative, teamed up with the United Nations to raise awareness and honor refugees with a festival at City Hall's courtyard. More than 53,000 refugees settled in the United States last year. Now in the celebration's 17th year, the event recognizes the global refugee crisis while honoring the strength, courage, and resilience of the growing number of people forced to flee their homes each year. We spoke with one of the 700 refugees living in Philadelphia. Degashi Akwasi traveled to Philadelphia from Morocco just two weeks ago. In Morocco, it was not safe for the homosexuals. Even though there is no intermittent attacks in the city, but it was not safe. And uh, I understand that here it's safe for the homosexuals to live their own sexual life the way they like. So I prefer to come here. And the festivities are expected to continue here at City Hall. A Sundance film will be shown. It features four Syrian refugees who are resettling in Baltimore, Maryland. That's the very latest live at City Hall. Shantae Lands, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Shantae, thank you.